In this video, we will see how WebRV can be configured to extract data from multiple pages of a website's listing. So for example, if we go to Amazon.com and search for any product, for example, mobile phones, and perform the search, you can see that uh, the products are displayed, which confirms to the search we uh, provided. And if we scroll down to the bottom of the page, we can see that there are additional pages and where you can see similar products listed. So if I click on the next page, it will load the second page of listing and so forth. So in this video, we will see how a Parvi can be configured to automatically click the next page and load subsequent pages so that the data which you configure in the start page is repeated for all the subsequent pages. So this technique which websites employ to display products or listings or data in multiple pages is called pagination. And if you go to WebRV website and click the help section and go to capture data from multiple pages on the left, you can see that there are various types of pagination and all these links explains how these various types of pagination can be uh, handled during the configuration process. So let's uh, deal each one of uh, these cases through examples. And let's go to the first example, which is the very normal case of uh, pagination, which is employed by most websites. So in this case, the example, the, web, the website is TripAdvisor. And I have, I'm already in configuration mode. I have selected uh, the hotel names. And if I scroll down to the bottom of the page, you can see that there are links to more pages of listings and there is also a next page. So how do I configure WebRV for automatically selecting data which I configured from multiple pages? And it is done by clicking the next button or the direct link to load page number two. So click on the next button. If uh, the website provides a next button to load the next page or click directly on uh, the link to load the next page that is page number two. So in this case, let's click on the next button and from the resulting capture window and there is an option in the capture window called the set as next page link. So just click on this and it's simple. You have configured WebRV to select or describe the data which you have selected. That is the name in this case from multiple pages of this listings. Now you can select additional data and follow links of each listings if you want as shown in previous videos. But for the sake of this example, let's stop the configuration process and start mine. And in the minor window, there is an option called mine all pages, which is ticked right now. So what it means is that WebRV will try to load as many pages as possible from the website. So it basically tries to mine till the last page, or you can specify the exact number of pages which you need to mine and then click on the start mining, uh, the start button, which will start the mining process. So let's not go to that. Let's take another example. Uh, so, so if you go to WebHari's website, we have already discussed this first uh, case, which is normal pagination. And let's see another case of another website. And here also, we are in configuration mode. I have selected the title of the listing. As you can see, the name field is filled in the preview. And if I scroll down, you can see that there are pagination links to load pages 1 to 10. Now, the speciality of this website is that after I have loaded uh, page number 10, so let me stop the configuration here. If I load page number 10, and scroll to the bottom, you can see that there is no page number 11. There is no direct link to load page number 11. Instead, you have to click this link, these three dots here. So this will load the next set of 10 pages. See, it has now, sh it is now showing links to pages 11 to 20. And if I click again on these three dots, it will show links for pages 21 to 30. So how do we configure WebRV to uh, scrape such a listing where 
you have individual page number links and when you reach a certain limit you have to click another link or button to load the next set of pages so this is explained in the second uh, section which is pages where pagination links are shown in sets so you can refer the same example is described in the website let's now see how we can configure so i start the configuration process and select the basic data from the page so let's select the name and then i scroll down and first thing i should do is click on the direct link to load page number two that is the link to load page number two click on the link and set it as next page link now once i have done that click on these three dots or the link or the button which would load the next set of pages so click on the link and from more options you have this option called set as load next page set this is currently the last option in the more options pop-up menu click on that and you have now configured web harvey to mine data from multiple pages even beyond page 10 so when the power view reaches page turn it will click this uh, button or link to load the next set of pages and proceed automatically and as before in the minor window you can specify the number of pages to mine or select mine all pages now let's uh, take another example the third case where pages uh, have a load more button at the end of the listing and when you click on that the page will load additional data within the same listing so let's take this website and you, you can see the listings on the left and there's a map view on the right if I scroll down the listing you can see that there is a load more results button so what happens when you click on this button is that the website will load additional data within the same page itself there is no new page so data will start to appear at the end of the page more and more as you click this button more so how do i configure web harvey uh, in such cases well it's also simple click on the load more results button or link at the end of the listing and click on the more options button and select the option set as show load more data link so if you set on this and then stop configuration and start mine you can see that you can specify the number of pages to mine please note that in this case mine all pages option will be disabled now this is because web harvey does not know when the data loading ends so this option will be disabled but you can uh, you can enter uh, the number of pages manually in this text box and then start the mining now another thing to add here is that while you are uh, in the configuration when you have started configuration if you go to the configuration menu here there is an option called urls button here if you click on that Bhavavi gives you a window with a box where you can enter additional urls so if i add multiple urls per line to this list here Web Harvey will try to scrape each and every one of those links using the configuration which we create. So this is a method whereby you can manually submit the next page URLs. The only condition is that all the additional URLs which are entered in this list should be of the same design or layout or should belong to the same website domain as that of the starting URL for which you created the configuration. Now let's go to another example that is uh, the section 4 which explains how data how you can configure web harvey to scrape data from pages where additional data is loaded in the same page as you scroll down so let's take another example so here is a website and if i scroll down to the bottom of the page you can see that more data is loaded in the same page there is no next button there is no load more button so more data is loaded on the same page as you scroll down this is also known as an infinite scroll so how do we configure web harvey to scrape multiple data from such pages well start the configuration select the data which you need and 
Before following links, to get additional data, you should go to the configuration menu and under pagination, there is an option called scroll to load next page. Just select this link and you have configured Web Harvey to automatically scroll the page as many times as you need to extract data. So if I stop configuration and start mine, again, you can specify the number of pages from which Web Harvey need to extract data. In this case also, the My All Pages option is disabled because Web Harvey does not know when the pagination will end. So you have to manually provide the number of pages you need to mine. So right now we have uh, discussed all the major uh, pagination styles and how they can be configured using Web Harvey. There are two more uh, uh, techniques and those require a video of themselves. So we can go through them in brief in this video. Uh, the first one is URL based auto pagination and this is useful in cases where the URL contains the page number and when all other methods of uh, pagination fails. So both these uh, techniques which we are going to discuss now can be used or needs to be used only when all other techniques fail. So when you have a page number within uh, the URL of each page, then you have a method whereby you can add uh, the next page URLs in an encoded format in the add URLs form. So you can refer this link to know more details regarding that. And the next option is to load the next page via JavaScript. And as you can see, under configuration menu, under pagination panel, there is a set JavaScript option. If you click on that, you can provide a JavaScript which would load the next page. So both these options provide more uh, power to the user to handle all types of paginations and methods. So I hope you find this video useful. If you have any questions, as always, you can contact our technical support. Link in the description below. Yeah.